Let us continue playing Dungeon Keeper. Dark Sword. A great battle has been won here. It was a bit one sided, granted, but our minions performed valiantly, and now the day is ours. We've dealt with the survivors, by the way, properly. Good. Now, on to the final area. Skybird Trill, the ultimate in cute. A frown in Skybird Trill brings all the townspeople to the sufferer's door with gifts of love, fine cheer, and eternal friendship. A place where nothing can ever go wrong, or so they fondly believe. So let's make things go wrong. There are a few issues that we will encounter in Number one of these is that there is an enemy keeper, and he has a level 10 vampire. And this pr means he's likely to get, well before we're anywhere near prepared, a scavenger room. And we are unlikely to ever get vampires, or rather we'll just be giving him vampires, so I will not be building at all any form of graveyard. It is possible to beat him to scavenger rooms and take his vampires, but the risk is quite a big one. So we're not going to do it. In the meantime, while we have people digging towards gems, yep, we have unlimited gold really for this mission, we need to set up the dungeon. So, so we want hatchery. Here, training room. Large training room. Uh, up top, we should already have the treasure room sorted. What's that? Only need a basic one for the moment. We can build a one a bit closer later. Now, next to this, because it'll then be out of the way, we do want to build. A library. This has got to be a reasonably large one. We'd prefer to get dragons, of course, um, than warlocks, but we'll take what we can get. Speaking of which, we do need to expand this if we're going to get use for dragons. So. There. Hatchery, training room, library. Okay, so that's the main five sorted out. Now there's no risk of going to the gems here. We can, we can do this, uh, so we shall. The portal's already been claimed over there, but obviously we have no rooms available. Now, this, as I remember, is quite significant. We shall be ignoring it, though. At least a short term. Slap and work harder. We need a big enough treasure room to attract dragons. And that one as well, in fact, just to be sure. We'll get that dug out at some stage. Right, lair. We will need to set up for Biles. And since we're having dragons, we'll need to expand that periodically. Gold's running low. That's because there's not a treasure room near here, actually. Okay, come on. There we go, so now we can dig to the gems. Well, digging, to, digging out the gold is quicker, so we'll try and get some of that done first. 
also provides room for a um, treasure room nearby. Right, now that we have a bit more gold, let's expand the hatchery. Uh, put that by four. Oh well. Expand that if we need to. Training room. here but we're gonna do it anyway. First creature has arrived and it is a dragon. Hello dragon. We have got a big enough one. You can train for the moment. We'll get the library built soon. Just as soon as we got a bit of cash coming in. Now note what we can't build. That makes certain aspects of this level quite challenging. But for the moment, uh, naturally I've just had a fort there. I'm gonna dig out that. And probably there as well. Right, next we want to expand and improve this slightly. With a couple of additional entrances. Next, just expand that. And then finally, we want to get a library ongoing. Right, that should do for the short term, and that will have attracted Mild Demon, actually. That's fine. You do your training. You. Now that you're level two, come on. Yeah, I was about to say, you might as well do research the short term because we seem a bit low on that. They already have six creatures, but they're not the thing we have to worry about really in this level. At the moment, what we have to worry about is just getting enough gold. Now there are no less than uh, four. Sorry, nearly got that wrong. No, no less than four level up specials on this um, stage. We will use them much, much later. Of course, we do have to find them as well, but that's beside the point. Right, so that's the library in. Next up, we want the workshop. The long workshop of horrors. Right, so that's in. We need a small library, a uh, small barrack somewhere, but we'll won't put it here. We shall put it here because it doesn't need to be very large. This can also be where we put the temple, I guess. Alright, just thinking. So, prison complex last. That can go here. Lots of gold already generated. And then down here. Go for torture chamber. As already said, we're not really going for um, not really going for anything else. We might be scavenging a bit later, but that'll be the only other room we really need to build here. That is pretty much the layout of our dungeon, and we have learned speed monster. So. A speed boost. From you to you, no, no. from you as well, sir. You still have the V chance of getting there first, but 
unfortunately the only way we'll know that is if um, we have a go. In the meantime, we need bile demons trained as high as we can get them. Just add another layer to this. Or another few layers. But that should now do. A new spell has been researched. The must obey spell. Uh, they're, all they're still sped up, so we shall speed up. You and you. In the meantime, dragon number three has arrived. Whom we shall speed up. So, everything going okay for the moment. Now, no sight of evil either, but if I remember rightly, we don't want to go in there. Just yet. That's the guard post. I want to make one more imp here because he needs to really claim this area. So you can then put another treasure room down here. I seem to recall we really don't want to um, dig too much of this out. But I don't know whether this is me being cautious and remembering things I don't remember or whether I'm actually remembering something that went wrong. Either way, we'll be cautious with this. And just dig out anything which isn't connected to the edge. We still have the gems, of course, so... There we go. So four dragons have now arrived. Where's dragon number four? And it would appear the speed spells have worn off, so let's go and... oh no. Speed spells are on. They're just about wearing off though. Right, and a third bile demon. So this is all going quite nicely. Pile up to level three. Prison area being dug out already. And lots and lots of gems being dug out, though not the middle one, because that's silly. Next up. That will be put in. A new room has been researched. And the workshop. So let's uh, make one more imp. Things up to 21. We should. 22, sorry. Because I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Do that and do that. Makes more sense. Be a bile demon number four that's just arrived. So, four and four. Bile de demons, the living tanks that they are, will do fine for us. Shall we, though, is go and give you your home. A new spell has been researched. Grab three imps to go yoink, yoink, yoink. Grab you and put you back in training. Trust me, this, is, this may not seem like it's being very much worth it, but monsters with speed are always worth researching with. Okay, I think the rest of them are more 
Nope, you are not anymore. And at the moment, our oh shit, we're producing a lot more gold than we're spending, so... This is all fine for the moment. You have tunneled into a new area. Oh god! Your creatures are under attack. Your creatures need a bigger lair. Yeah, we've just let a in a level 10 sir. tentacle. I knew there was a... <sighs> okay. It's not panic just yet. But I don't see exactly how we can do this. We don't have any way of preventing them from just going, Hello! Because they will do soon. I can keep grabbing imps, but they're going to get there eventually. Right, let's give you some gold to dig out. We do not want to attract their attention. Your creatures need a bigger lair. Not if we can. Okay, bigger lair needed. Thankfully, we do have lair space. Uh, we need a bit of a miracle to take on those now. Your creatures are under attack. Dang it. What did I tell you? We're just gonna have to hope everything's a match for some tentacles. Your creatures are the only enemy. If we had a prison, we might have been able to do uh, catch them and then just. Arrgh. Such a waste this, even if we win. Oh, 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 brilliant. I'm still not convinced we can take them, but if we can, take them. It's a level four something. Probably a bile. And level one dragon. Your creatures are under attack. Yes, I know. We're under attack. We have no healing. No easy healing, anyway. Oh, God. We are finished. There's a little too many of them. Your creatures are attacking the enemy. If we had healing abilities, we might be able to do something, but... Well, what have we learned? Don't let in a load of tentacles. Your creatures are under attack. We're not a match for them. So what I'm going to do... Oh no, we'll wait. It's still not out of the question, but... But, oh, dang it, we lost a level 2 pile there. We got one of them out. You're going to have to fight for your paychecks. Not bothered about the imps. Money and ability to get the imps back. All we need to do is we need to run around the houses with these guys a bit. Your creatures are under attack. Darn 
damn it. Nope, it's not going to work. There's exactly one of them that's wounded. And they have freeze abilities. See why I like the tentacles, really? Every one of those reasons is saying, I don't like the tentacles right now. Are but they're basically out of dungeon heart. The enemy. So we're gonna have to load. Game loaded. Oh, and it means I've gotta go back through this. Your right, two moments and I'll restart.